All right. Well, those that are in are in. Even though more people are coming in right now, they're going to have to wait. Um, I just want to. Oh shit. Okay. I just want to thank everybody for being here and just kind of give you some information in regards to some of the things that are happening that I think can help you recruit and build yourself a nice team. And there's no better time to do that than right now for a lot of reasons I'm not going to get into. But we all know if it means enough to you, you'll give it a shot. And I encourage everybody to do that. But first things first, this is the last webinar. <coughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, this is the last webinar that we are using the old text alert list. If you want to be on the new text alert list, meaning the text message you just got, you're going to have to text Crusaders to 74121. Crusaders 74121. We are flushing the other one and purging it out. We've got literally 400 and something people on that list. I don't know how the hell everybody got on it, but if you want to remain on the text alert list, you're going to have to text Crusaders with an S to 74 one, two, one. And that will get you up and running with the new list, which is going to go down dramatically because we are purging it. This is the last uh, time that the only other text you're going to see on this one is going to let people know if you want to stay on the list, this is what you have to text in now versus anything else. And so anyways, Crusaders, 74121, and you're on the new list. Otherwise, you're not going to get anything moving forward. I don't think I have to tell you this, but the market took a dump on Friday. And I'm not saying it's a good thing for anybody because it's not, but it definitely highlights the power, if you would, of the concepts that we market that revolve around the whole essence of going up when the market goes up and never going down. And, you know, there's a lot of people that say, yeah, but the market always comes back. And that is very true. In most cases, it comes back. Number one, we don't know when. And number two, you just lost the compounding effect of your money when you do that. So, again, keep in mind that this is the time. You want to hit up your clients and reassure them that, hey, you're on the right track with us. Just I know you've heard nightmares that the market dropped over a thousand points on Friday, and it is true. I just want to reassure you that you haven't lost a penny. And then, of course, that's when you go back and you hit them up for referrals, offer them the four-day, three-night stay in wherever you are offering currently right now. Uh, on the Marketing Boost side of the house, if you didn't get the email, check the Marketing Boost Facebook group. They just <clears throat> expanded another resort in Cabo, another one in uh, Cancun, which is simply incredible. I mean, it's getting out of control. And so it's in a good way, of course. So make sure you continue to leverage those as much as you possibly can. Also on the Bacon of Vegas campaign, what I'm really excited to uh, let you know is that we have a few people who have crossed the finish line in regards to getting their first uh, dates up with police departments. And just like I told you last week, we don't take, we don't call dibs on anything. Whoever gets the date first wins. That's just the way it is. Every year we have somebody saying, well, I spoke to a cop at that station and blah, blah, blah. And, and what happened? Well, I haven't heard from them. Okay, well, maybe they don't want to deal with you or maybe they just not the right person. And so, again, no matter, it doesn't matter who it was, what police station, when somebody crosses the finish line, it's a, done, it's a, it's a done deal. So let me just go ahead and continue before the thing starts to talk. Um, let me go over here because I'm not going to, I'm going to gonna show you the, Vegas. last week I showed you the uh, link to get the video. And that's how people got the dates. They just simply texted the video link that I gave you last week. And boom, we're in. Just that simple. It's not easy, but it's simple. Uh, also, this coming Tuesday at 10 a.m., we're going to have the uh, webinar by invitation only on the preset appointments that you get to purchase with educators that a lot of our teammates have been using for years. So it's by invitation only. I know that some of you filled out the questionnaire. If you filled out the questionnaire, which you can find here, and you meet the criteria, You'll be invited. If you don't, you won't. Very, very simple. So I uh, just want to let you know that the meeting is this Wednesday morning at 10 a.m. And so just check your email to see if you're part of that campaign. And if you are, you'll uh, hear the final invitation is going out on uh, uh, today, this afternoon. And it's a great way to, again, <clears throat> grow your business, if you would, from wherever you might be and just leverage the power of preset appointments. But only if you are in that market, if you know how to calculate counselors, CalPERS, pensions, and so on. And you can pass the audition training, the training, and then we're going to do auditions for everybody. And then you're going to be in for that campaign, which we really need to get going to make sure that it's not going to really uh, impact the in uh, income as much by jumpstart. But by next June, we want to see people's income double. And this is going to be a key component, along with all the other stuff that we have going on right now. I also want to take a moment to pull away from this for just one second and share something with you that's happening as we speak, and I just want to take a moment to congratulate here, and I'll put it up on the screen in just one second. I want to congratulate these uh, fine gentlemen 
for a job well done. Let me pull this up for you real quick. And you'll see what I'm talking about because it talks about it and it really, hold, hold on. I got somebody text uh, messaging me. I'll read it in one second. Let me just open this up. And here it is. Bob, can you see the Facebook? Yep. Okay. And so I just want to throw some kudos out to Mr. Alan Guerra. Uh, also, Andy and also Joel are with him working an event out in the desert. And uh, what, what is that? The Palm Springs area, I think? Desert? Uh, yeah, well, right there, Indian Wells. Okay, it's in Indian Wells. And yes. It, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, it's right here in Indian Wells, right next to uh, Palm Springs. Yes. Palm Springs. Thank you. And I just want to congratulate you, Alan, on a job well done. And I'm talking about not just bringing key people with him to grow the church campaign. How many pastors are there, Alan? Uh, act, uh, attending, uh, I'd say about 20. Okay, pastors. perfect. Good, good. And how's it going so far? We're doing great. I have uh, Andy with me and Joel uh, that have been here for all three days. And we're just connecting with people, connecting with pastors. Uh, getting appointments, giving away uh, the hotel. Uh, we made a commitment to everyone that attended the event. We were going to give them a two hundred dollar uh, hotel discount card. So that's bringing them in. That's bringing people to stop at the table. And then once they stop here, then we upgrade them uh, to not just the hotel discount card, but also a free uh, getaway to Cabo, um, Cancun, or Las Vegas if they will allow us to do a, a financial review. So that's bringing them in. Perfect. Okay. Great, great job. And this is the setup that they have right there. As you can see, it screams professionalism. It screams they know what they're talking about. And it, of course, highlights the, like he said, $200 hotel savings card that will get people to your booth, to your event, whatever. And that's part of Marketing Boost as well. And so just want to congratulate all these uh, gentlemen right here. The three amigos is what I'm calling them. Uh, they're out in the desert doing great things for churches and for people and for pastors. And so I just want to congratulate all of them, but especially Mr. Alan Guerra, the key leader there, making this all happen. So great job, guys. Congratulations to you all. And uh, I know you're going to do us proud by just going out there and empowering people to secure the financial future and doing everything that needs to be done. So thank you so much, Alan, Alan and uh, Andy, as well as Quail, on a job well done. Now, let me just thank continue you. and go back over here to the PowerPoint, because now, can you see... Uh, Bob, if you're on still, I'm sure you are. Um, what do you see, Bob? Do you see the... Uh... Still see Alan, the three amigos. Okay. The three amigos. Okay, let me just go back over here. How about now? You're, now? you're on the PowerPoint. Okay, perfect. Thank you, sir. And so, like I said, uh, oh, this is just the QR code for the uh, email list that I was talking about the appointments earlier. I'm not going to get into that. We spoke of that. Uh, but what we're going to get into today is learning how to market or how to recruit, I should say, via email. That encompasses a couple of things. Number one, you having your actual place to send them to. And so you should have a domain that you can send them to because one of the things that's critical when it comes to recruiting in big numbers is you have to automate yourself to a large degree. And so we've done about maybe a million and a half webinars on the recorded VOPs that I have. We've given out, or I've given out the link about one and a half million times as well. So I'm not going to get into that. But the key thing here for everybody is to start with either A, a place to send them. And so either A, <clears throat> what you can do is you can go ahead and just simply send them uh, to a, a YouTube video if that's where you have your presentation, or you can send them to you know, whatever. The point is that you have to have a place to send them to. And if not, in the worst case scenario, your Calendly, where you're going to put them on your calendar for you to give them a call back. Now, one of the best ways that I found to grow my team has always been email marketing. And the best way to do email marketing, we spoke about this on several occasions, for me has worked like a charm, has been Eventbrite. So what I do is I create an event on Eventbrite and it's webinar based. That way I can hit people wherever. Because if I do a physical event here in <coughs> excuse me, Ontario, I'm going to limit myself to who can attend because of traffic and whatever. But if I do it online, and to be honest with you, I don't even care about the online event. What I care is that Eventbrite is going to let me email 6,000 people a day by doing that. And so I send out the invitation. And when I send out my invitation, I always, and I mean, I always go ahead and say, do you want to know more now? Click here for a 24-7 presentation or call slash text me at this number. 
And so now you have the webinar event in case they really do show up to the event, which most don't. Then you have a 24 seven recorded presentation or opportunity presentation. And then of course, after, on top of that, if they really wanna know more, you can go ahead and leverage the power of just a phone call or a text to you. And so let me ask you a question. When you recruit people here well, uh, to FFS, what are you recruiting them to? I mean, there's two things that you have to answer when you're recruiting or building a team. Why FFS and then why life insurance sales? I mean, your opportunity in the whole, tell me your best power phrase, why come on board with us? Anybody? Just one person and we're gonna go down the line because I'm not here to just talk. I'm here to interact with you. Anybody? Well, free preset appointments. That's pretty powerful right there. You can come work with us and what we offer our preset appointments. Now, that is pretty vague because what we're doing, we, I'm not, so who, who's that, George? I don't know who the hell it was. Yes. Oh, about time. You said something smart. Anyways, but uh, the point is that that's pretty cool because I am not trying to psych them up. That's the biggest mistake people make. They throw all kinds of love at them, trying to you know get them all hot and bothered, and then they try to psych them up. And that's not what you need to do. You can't skip all the important steps. My goal in the beginning is to get your information. And I get that information by either registering for the webinar. I get that information by going to my landing page. I get that information by you texting me a question or two. So the key word here is compel. You must learn to compel people to give you your info, whether they join or not, whether they buy or not, whether they become clients or not, means nothing. That's not what you're trying to do. And way too many people do that. And so for me, <clears throat> I know that the only thing I'm ever short of are email addresses. Because if I can get my hands on email addresses and I can put my marketing on autopilot where every single day, every day, I can shoot out 6,000 emails to Eventbrite, the only question is what I'm going to send them. So if you don't have anything else, schedule a webinar on Eventbrite for life insurance agents. Once you, and you know what, let me just show you one thing so you can kind of get a better sense of what I'm talking about. And then I'm going to get into how you're going to do it with this tool. Because one of the top complaints, well, not complaints, but some of the pro top problems people have, or they say they have, which they don't, but they think they have, is that I don't have a list. Well, I'm going to show you how to obtain emails for anybody anywhere on earth, especially here, of course, in the United States, which is where we are uh, recruiting. So let me show you that. But let me go ahead. Pull it. I know you can't see it yet. I'm pulling it up. So bear with me while I pull it up. I got to go to my past events. And I'm going to actually show you one. And let's see. Here. And so I'm going to pop one up. This is a little old one, but it doesn't matter. It got me a few people. But uh, what I'm going to show you now is this. Let me go ahead and pull it up. I'm going to open it up on a clean browser so you can actually see what I'm talking about. All the avenues of this whole thing. So, okay. So here we go. Let me show it to you right now. And Hopefully, Bob, can you just let me know in just one second, please, if you can see my browser. Can you see my browser? Browser, life agents. Yeah. Okay, there you go. And so this is what it is. So this was an uh, event that I did, Life Agents Wanted, preset appointments provided. That's what you want to do. Where you want to entice them. Now, when you go in here, you're going to create your event, right? As you kind of you can see right now. And when you go in here, you're going to put the basic information. Location for me is online. Because that, first of all, I don't want to drive anywhere, so I'm going to do it on the day of the event, whether somebody shows up or not. But the part that's important is this right here, which is are the details. So when you start to go into the details, let me go see if I can pull up this one right here. Uh, because the problem with this one is that it already ended. So it's not going to show it to me because it's already ended. But I wanted to see it. It won't let me do that. But the point is that all you're doing is enticing people. All you're doing is enticing them to come to your funnel. Now, my favorite funnel, let me just pull this up right here. My favorite, oh God, hold on. My favorite funnel, of course, is my 24 seven video that I send people to. And I've given it to all of you every single time. So I'm not gonna do that today. We don't have time uh, for that. But the point that I'm making is that you wanna leverage that. Now, the question is, if you know how to do all that, who do you email? Well, here's where the class be, uh, is gonna begin. And here's where it's going to end. Do you see email extractor, Bob? Yes, yes. There's a tool called Email Extractor Pro. It's what it's technically called. And I use it when I need to go on a campaign 
for anyone in any industry in the world, which is, of course, we're limited to the United States. So let me give you an example. If I want to recruit, and I would never do this, by the way, but if I wanted to recruit, let's just say, Primerica agents, right? All I need to do is find out what is their extension to their email. And then I just simply plug it into the email extractor, which happens to be in this example, I'm going to actually show it to you <clears throat> in action. So just bear with me so you can see what it is I'm referring to. And so here it is. So what I'm going to do is in real time show you how this bad boy works. So let me just go back over here. There's several ways to do this. And let me just go ahead and show you one of them. And I I'm going to show you more. So we're going to go into email extractor. Very simple thing. And so if you can see at the top, I just typed in Primerica. Or I can type in it because I know that their email ends at Primerica.com. That's just the way it is for them. So if I type that in and then I just simply hit start, it'll start crawling the web, literally crawling the web. Now, what I'm going to do instead of the uh, that one, because I don't want extensions, you can you can search for emails or URLs. We just want emails. So I'm going to go back to Primerica and hit start. And all of a sudden, you can start to see different email addresses at Primerica. And so what I'm getting, and I would never recruit Primerica. You don't want to recruit. But the point that I'm making is that, see, here's Joe at some whatever. But the point that I'm making is you can come in here and literally create a database of anybody. So here's Susan Chan at Primerica. Here's that. I mean, if that's what you wanted to do. Now, like we're talking about the LAPD. Well, at the LAPD, if you Google, uh, how do I email a local police officer? You'll see that their email address usually ends up dot, uh, .lapdonline.org. And so if I come in here, let me just stop this one. The, that's, this is, one hold on this is one of them right here so i'm hit start to see if anything pops up and then again you literally go in here um lapd online so, so all of a sudden you start to see different results and so what i'm saying is that you can let this thing run for half an hour or an hour let it you know let it mine the literally the entire web and all of a sudden you're, you're going to start to see different results now Obviously, based on what you're looking for, it could be, let's just say, uh, you might be looking for State Farm agents, if you're looking at, you might be looking at AFLAC agents, if that's what you're looking for. Now, I don't know what the hell an AFLAC agent uh, email address ends. Does anybody know? But let me just type um, AFLAC. Okay, I'm just going to type that in, see what it gives me. And so what it's going to start to do, and there it is. Shareholder at AFLAC, pop up at AFLAC. Um, ADB benefits at AFLAC. And so what I'm getting at all of a sudden, it starts to go to work for you. Now, many times you have to be careful not to go into the corporate because what they do, the field gets an email and then in corporate gets a different email. It's like, you know, ours is not FFS.com. You would have to be a little more savvy because there's, you know, at FFS online and there's all kinds of stuff. So uh, again, you can kind of see here, D Young at AFLAC. And so what I'm getting at, this tool will allow you to literally go in there and mine the different information. Hey, Javier. Go ahead. This is Stephanie. I work for AFLAC. It's um, at us.aflac.com. Okay, that's what you I'm just saying. put in AFLAC that goes to the corporate office. That's what I thought. That, that's very common, by the way. With Okay, so you, US, what is it? US? US.aflac.com. Okay. So let me just see if what this gives me. Now, sometimes you want to mess with it until you fine tune how this is actually. And whoa, there you go. All of a sudden, a lot of different hell. You've been getting, uh, I mean, as you can see, the point that I'm making is that there's different ways for you to approach this, and it will help you set up your database of who you're going to approach. Because remember, once I get all these email addresses from here, I just simply go into my Eventbrite and I'm able to hit. 6,000, 6,000 emails a day with Eventbrite. And the same holds true if you're going to go after, let's just say LAPD. You know, I'm just going to throw it in there to see what I, what I get here. Now, you'll get resources sometimes with the URL, meaning the websites, uh, which you can go in there to dig for what the extension is for their email address because it's not the same thing. 
or you could just simply go ahead and start getting email addresses right out of the gate from them. Because I know for LAPD, it's not LAPD.com. That's what most people think. And that's just simply not the case. Uh, let me stop this right here. And so what I think is really cool about this is that what I just showed you right now, this software is free. You don't even have to pay for it. And so what I'm going to do is, and if you look at this LAPPL, that's their that's the league or their union, if you would. LAPPL right here. Um, LACity.org right here. That is from the city. And so what I'm getting at, depending on who you're going after, maybe you're going after Kyrie. I learned, and one of the best things I learned from my mentor in this business, meaning leadership and recruiting and building, is learn to go after select masses of people in waves. So I'm going after the Bacon Vegas people right now. Uh, with Alan's help right now, we're going after churches. And at the same time, I'm working with police officers and we're going after the teachers. We're prepaid. So we're doing it all. We're doing it all. And that's how you get the tons of success in that. Because if some, if I recruit somebody and they get intrigued by the whole police department thing in working with law enforcement, I can throw them in a car. I'll never forget. I'm not going to say this person's name, but the way I recruited this person who has made hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars with us, I'll never forget it. This person replied to my email and I met with this person at, anyways, we met at a Starbucks type of place. I gave her some information as to what we do. She's like, but I'm really intrigued with the police departments. I mean, you really do work with the officers themselves. And I was like, I closed my laptop, stopped the presentation. And I told her, look, if you really want to see how this works, meet me tomorrow at 5 a.m. I'm not going to go do a roll call and you can kind of see it. Block off a few hours so we can actually go see some officers first. She's like, I would love it. Next day, we met at 5 a.m. We drove to the police station together. I did the roll call presentation. For after the roll call presentation, we went to breakfast uh, about 9 a.m. We went to see the first police officer. Boom, $300 a month app IUL application on the spot. I explained to her. That's about a $3,000 target premium based on your contract. You do the math, right? Uh, I told him, do you have time to go to another one? We're going to another one right down the street. Yeah. So we went to see the other police officer. Boom. $500 a month IOL application on the spot. And by the time we wrapped that one up, I go, you want to go another one? She was like, I got to go, but I just want to know how do I join this? And she has gone on to you know, make hundreds of thousands of dollars here on our team and in the process Everybody has made money, including myself, as part of that production. And I can't tell you how all of it started with this, the led to that, to show it to them. And then you go from being the hunter to being the hunted because they are going to want to work with you. Now, look down here. We have stuff like Indio Station at RiversideSheriff.org. Now, I know the extension for the Riverside Sheriff's email. There it is at Riverside. That's, that's pretty cool. This is a, a police officer, Ken, whatever the hell his name is, at LAP, LAPD.LACD.org. That's their email address that I was telling you about. Viega, blah. I mean, I'm in business. I'm in business. And so when you talk to a police officer, what would, what would you email them? What are you going to send them? Well, hopefully, the reason we're, we're segmenting them in law enforcement type of, uh, uh, of list is because I'm going to launch. Which campaign am I going to launch with them? What am I going to talk to them about? Anybody? Give me your best police officer. Give me your best one-liner for police officers as to what you do. Just one single line. And don't ask me. Tell me. Bulletproof your uh, money. That's one way. Another somebody else. With kudos. Kudos to you. Somebody else. Come on, guys. Come on. I'm not wasting my time here on a Saturday morning to talk to a screen. So if you're not going to be participating, we can just wrap it up and I'll just send a recording of these classes. What keeps you up at night? Okay. I mean, I, I, exactly. Anybody else? Come on. God, just learn how to try. Lock in your interest rate. Okay. I mean, what I'm saying is that the more you say it, the more you think about it, the more you're going to refine it. And if you were to ask me, the first thing and the only thing I tell anybody that's in law enforcement, what we do is we show you how you can bulletproof your financial future. Financial future means a lot of things to a lot of different people. 
What does that mean to, what can that mean to somebody, a police officer? What does that mean? One thing, what does that mean? What could that mean? No holes, no shots. Okay, well, that's one thing. Yeah, but hopefully the, the, their vest does that. Yeah, but uh, in regards to the financial future, anybody? Retirement. If you okay, can't somebody just money, said it. Thank you for retirement. Whoever said that, you guys need to learn to speak up. Um, so retirement. Yes, that's one of them, of course. What the hell are you going to talk to them about? That's one thing. What else? What did I just tell you when we when we opened up the, uh, the the presentation today? What was a big slide about? What was one of the big things we talked about right away? B to B. What is okay? The, oh, that's one thing. That, by the way, will lead you to the masses of cops because that. Who's your team captain? Sound intelligent, right? That you know the the whole. Even you've never been on a, a damn break of Vegas. Just say, hey, who's your team captain? Do you guys run it this year? Are you guys going to need money for it? Okay, but the other thing that we spoke about was what the Dow Jones just took a dump, right? What does that mean to a cop? Tell me, what does that mean to them? What's the number one vehicle they use for savings for retirement? What is it? Four fifty seven plan. Their four fifty seven plan is behind. What is it? What is it called? Her comp. Deferred yep, retirement account. And what what happened to every single deferred comp in America this past week? It dropped. It went down. It took a dump. Of course. And so what I'm saying is, how easy could it be? Remember, now I'm sure you've all studied. I'm sure you've all studied the police power phrases I've given you a million times, where you ask a question, they start to answer it, and then immediately you take control with another question. Let me give you an example. Did you hear what the stock market did on Friday? Anybody play along? No. What happened? Okay, well, it took a dump. Okay, somebody else says yes. Did you hear what happened to the stock market on Friday? Yeah. yeah. But, I mean, it went down just a little bit. It went, actually went down over what? A thousand okay. points. Over a thousand points. So can you imagine all the officers that have a deferred comp? What happened to their balance on Friday? It dropped. It dropped. Uh -huh. A lot. With, the concepts, with the concepts that we teach you, you go up, but you never go down. Now, if you have to choose between the type of account that can go up and go down, meaning make money and lose money, when God knows that will be, or one that only makes you money and you never have to risk it again. Those are the kinds of concepts we teach police officers about. That's what I'm saying. you got to be able to. So what the hell are you going to do with that email if somebody responds? You gotta be on your toes. You got you got you have to do much better than you're doing right now because from a one to ten, you guys are at a two. I mean, that's just the reality. <laughs> We've been doing this too long. And so that's why I'm telling you, your confidence is gonna go up, your results are gonna go up. And when your results go up, guess what? You want more of it. But when you're not ready, you don't do anything, you feel bad, you don't do anything. Well, you feel even worse next week, and then you do even less. And so what I'm saying is that if you're going to do this, don't do this to just simply I have a great webinar coming up in a little bit. And I have one, here's what I, I'll, I'm going to cut it a, a little short. Let me just show you one slide from that presentation that I'm going to show you that we're going to be doing. I'm not going to, well, you can look into it if you want to. I'm not telling you to get it or buy it, but here's one thing that I would encourage you to do that we are doing on the other side. So let me just find this slide that I want you to see. First of all, Bob, because you're my observer today, do you see something that says, oh, shit, where did it go? Um. It just disappeared on me. Hold on. Do you, do you see something that says pipeline or what do you see? Uh, nothing yet. Okay. So let me know when it pops up. It's going to pop up in just one second. Oh, I see what it is. Hold on. Let me just go back in here. There we go. Okay. So let me just go back and do it one more time. And you should see it right about now. It should say pipeline uh, pro. Do you see it? Yep. Okay, here's the software that I use to stay on top of my business, both recruiting and production. And I don't do this for just this uh, uh, company. I run multiple marketing teams in multi across multiple industries and they all make money. This is a, something called Pipeline Pro that I encourage you to visit. Don't even type in any anything to Google it. I'm gonna give you a, a specific link that gives you a discount because I like software that does not require monthly fees. That's just me. I like the ones that you just pay one time and you are done. There are upgrades, which I don't recommend you get, but this software right here is worth probably about four grand. I'm going to show you how to get a copy of it for only $37 lifetime, never monthly fees, unless you they suck you and you fall for the upsells. Don't do the upsells. But what this does, what I do with it in FFS, in mortgages, in real estate, in solar, 
all my teams make a lot of money because they know what's going on in their life, which most people have no damn clue what's going on in their life when it comes to business. I'm doing okay. I have a few cases going. I have a few deals in the pipeline. Show them to me. And most of the time, they can't show me a thing because they're that disorganized. And so what I'm getting at here, this is what this allows you to do. You can literally track all your cases, annuities, by whether it's annuity, what's an IUL, by this, a Kaizen, whatever the case. And you can see in one single place, this is called by a, a pipeline, the, hence the name Pipeline Pro. You can see that. Now, this is on a separate opportunity. I'm not, I'm not showing this to you, but this is what I have going with them right now. Not in gross sales, not in gross commissions, but in my money that I have right now. I lost 8,400. I have 67,000 open. Uh, this is, as a matter of fact, uh, you, you guys know her. I mean, she's with FFS as well. She's got, she's an agent. She's got, she's got 10 grand. I'm training her there. Uh, this is another guy that's in FFS. You guys know him, Red Stafford. He's at $152,000 in income right now as we speak. And so here's what I want to leave you with as it relates to this part. If you want to see this, I'm going to train on this next Saturday on FFS. Pipelineprofits.us. Do not upgrade to anything you know like when you buy something then then you click next and like well for a one-time fee that don't buy a damn thing 37 dollars 37 dollars lifetime no monthly fees there is a uh once you get hardcore and you show yourself to your shares about this there is a way to upgrade don't do anything right now 37 dollars one time you can use this for many as many companies as you are working with because i don't work with people who don't know where the hell they're going Everybody thinks they're going somewhere, they're heading in a certain direction, when in reality, they have no damn clue. Most people, not, all, not everybody. And so I like to work with people that we know for a fact, what are we working on right now? Because that will determine what we need to do tomorrow. So come Monday, I know I have to move this case from the app to make sure I just had an app um, submitted last week. It got approved literally in eight hours by National Life Group. The next day, I delivered it, pushed it through the entire pipeline all the way to payday. And so that's why I'm saying that you have to have something visual because I was talking to somebody about the, his business plan and he gave me the worst, worst uh, thing you ever want to hear from somebody. He says, I keep it up here. I'm like, oh my God, uh, you do not want to do that. You want to be able to look at it. You want to be able to show, you know what my wife does, uh, Marcella, she has this app on her phone and all she does all damn day is hang around this right here the funnel because she can hang around here and see we're on track to hit our, you know, uh, my minimum, you guys know me, my minimum is 10 grand a week, man. I need to make 10 grand every week. I don't care where it comes from or how many opportunities. I love multiple streams. Baba, I've never met a paycheck I didn't like, but the point is that it all boils down to having this in front of you because most people, if they saw how good they had it, they would get so motivated, they would do more. And on the other uh, side, of the flip side of the coin if people saw their pipeline blank, they would either finally get around to doing what needs to be done or quit. I tell people all the time, just tap out, buddy. Just tap the hell out because I'm telling you right now, it's going to mess up your marriage. It's going to mess up everything. When somebody thinks that success is coming down the road, when in reality, there is no road. There's nothing on it. There's no hope. And so that's why I'm telling you right now, consider something. I used to use uh, another one called HubSpot and it's a great CRM as well. Uh, but this one, a million times better, $37 one-time fee, and you get as much, and I do mean as many opportunities as you want, as many pipelines as you want, with as many companies as you want. So let me just bring this down. So do me a favor. Uh, don't call me during the week for this. Just take a picture of it if you have to uh, with your phone. Everybody has one of those things, and then we can go ahead and wrap it up by going back to the email. Any questions from anybody, by the way, about anything so far? Yes, sir. Just, uh, Shasika, just asking really quickly, uh, are you able to use the phone on that Pipeline Pro to call your yes. clients? Yes. Uh, here's a, no, no. Yes, no. For the $37 one, which is the one that I'm telling everybody should get to, to track. It's, that's what's called inbound. So you have to input everything. It, it's, if you, you can manage your calendar. I'm getting rid of Canonly. I'm getting rid of a lot of stuff because everything lives within this one. However, if you want to do outbound marketing, that, that one does cost $97 a month, which is nothing compared to how much it will help you make money. But I'm telling you right now, for most people, start with just the 37 lifetime, no monthly fees. But I have my app. And so it even gives you a phone number. 
So if I send you my phone number, and the reason that I'm doing this now is because if you see the power of email marketing before, when somebody went to Canadley, it just lived on Canadley forever unless I manually exported it and imported it into my HubSpot. Here, when I send you a link uh, for my calendar, and once you make an appointment, it takes you and puts you into my main database of contacts, and it tags you accordingly as well. And I mean, I'll talk about the full details next week, but for right now, we, what people need is a place to go and just see where their business stands at this moment. Because if you were to ask me, what do we need? We need a greater sense of urgency under our butts. If people saw where they really stood, they would be 10 times more active because either A, I see my pipeline and I, show, I showed you mine on the other one, whatever the hell it was, uh, 80, 80, whatever, $80,000. But how the hell is my downline rent at 150000 You know, how the hell is that? I mean, I can't let that happen. So guess what? I'm going to push to catch up to him. I called him the other day to brag that I broke 80000 and he's like, oh, you're almost halfway to me because I'm at 150. I'm like, what the hell? And, and that's what we want. That's what we want. We don't want to be sitting here, you know, screaming and yelling because nobody's doing a damn thing. I'm not talking about that. I don't have time for that. I'd rather just not do this on Saturdays and do something more productive, like watch the news with my wife. Or I really want to help everybody. I really, really want to help everybody succeed. But you're going to have to do your part and you're going to have to do things that matter. Too many times we do things that we want to think they matter when in reality doesn't mean a damn thing. You have to do the things that matter. App counts, recruit numbers. How many emails? If I was to ask you a question, how many email invitations did you send out this week just for recruiting purposes? Anybody? How many emails did you send out? Because I sent 12,000 out. And by the way, that was only two, two mail outs from Eventbrite. So you might ask yourself, what happened to the other three during the week? I forgot. I got I got lazy. But still, at least that's 12,000 right there. Uh, you know, How many apps did you submit? I'm sure some of you have numbers. How much did you make this week? Some of you have numbers. But collectively, we want to be able to max out those answers, if you, those, those answers with productive things as well. Any other question before we wrap it up from anybody? Please. Anything. Well, I just hope that you never take anything I say the wrong way. Uh, is that fair to say that we're big boys and big girls here? Uh, I just want to see you win. Some of you are not even on my team. I will never override you. And that's okay. I want you to win even more because I think everybody deserves to win. But you must earn it. Nothing's going to be handed to you. Nothing's going to be given to you. Uh, you know, you got to understand that, you know, praying every night is not going to do a damn thing unless we get up and do our part too, because it can't be just dumped on God's desk and magically us succeeding. We have to go out there and do it every single day. Any other questions from anybody about anything? Now, the name of the software yeah. here, let me just give it to you because I want to make sure you don't get the wrong one. There's uh, other ones that are out there that are not the real deal. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send you right now via chat the actual link, even though I think it was a Q. Was it a QR code that I put up there? Yeah. Yeah, she did. Thank you, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So never mind. You yeah. Ha I just wanted to say that. thank you, um, Javier, because I actually have the $97 version of this, but I'm paying $49 a month for it. And so you just saved the subscription. So thank you. Yeah. That's all you need to get the stamp. Yeah. Javier, what? I just wanted to, this, this is Devere. I just wanted to uh, thank you. This is my first time on, the, on, on one of your calls. So um, I appreciate it. I'm going. I'm going to uh, go ahead and sign up for the next for for the for the other one. And um, yeah, I I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you. And I'm telling you, every single one of you, you know me. I don't blow smoke. I, I, I'm not a motivated boo boo bullshit. I'm, I'm that kind of guy. Every single one of you is so close to where you want to be and you deserve to be. But the ultimate test is: Will you do your part when it matters? the most. That's what it boils down to. And all of you are so close. If you just come with me and join me on this extraordinary expedition to conquer a future together, it's amazing how much your fortune will turn literally almost overnight as long as you do your part. All right. Well, uh, any other questions? Remember, the other FFS is not going to work next week. So a lot of people are going to be disappointed and they're going to come complain to me that I didn't remind them to get on the webinar. Well, had they been on the webinar or had they seen the recording of the webinar, they know that we have a new code and it's Crusaders within this. Has anybody texted it in? Is it working? Has anybody texted? You should get replies saying I, you're I in. Or you're confirmed. Working. Or yes. Okay, because I haven't done it. So, okay, I'm going to do it right now because I forget. That's why every time I do webinars for people, I always ask them, oh, Anthony, hey, do me a favor. 
uh, about you know no no later than uh, 30 minutes, just text me because I get caught up in so many things, helping so many people that you know yesterday it almost happened. But anyways, so I, I got to sign up myself up to make sure I'm on that as well. I really appreciate everything that everybody does, and thank you for the success stories, whether it be the police, Baker of Vegas, anything. I really appreciate the feedback, so we can validate to other people that this stuff works when we work. Go ahead. Yeah, just looking for the um, when when you send that email out for the preset appointments. What's the subject line? Uh, it, uh, preset appointments webinar. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much, everybody. Have a great week. And I'll be talking to you again soon. Bye-bye.